Whether you've been working for weeks, months, or even years on a project, it can be good motivation to check in with your writing history to see how consistent you've been with writing each day. To find your writing history in Scrivener, make sure you've got that project open, open the project menu, and choose Writing History. Here you can see how much you've written on this project each day or each month. Obviously in this case I've been letting this project breathe since last year, but if we scroll down it's clear at a glance that I was writing 4 or 5 days a week in September of 2016, and my total word count for the month was about 13,500 words. Of course, if a character count would be better for you, you can switch between words and characters counted using this drop-down list in the top right. For this example though, we'll stick to looking at words. At the top, you'll see the number of days you've actually worked on this project, and an average of how many words were written each day, both in the draft folder and elsewhere. This list here will allow you to select whether you're looking at months and days, or just one or the other. Selecting a month from the list will show you some statistics for that month here at the bottom, and you can look at your average words per day in that period, as well as comparing your minimum and maximum output. Of course when numbers here are negative values, it means you've deleted more words than you've written that day. This export button down here on the left allows you to export these statistics to a CSV file, which can be easily opened by a spreadsheet application like Apple Numbers or Microsoft Excel. Last of all, it's worth noting that if you also edit this project in Scrivener for iOS on your iPhone or iPad, writing you do there is recorded for your writing history, and will appear when you open the writing history in the desktop version of Scrivener. That's all we're going to cover in this video. If you want to learn more about the features of Scrivener, our other videos should be linked nearby. Thanks for watching, and happy writing!